So here you go again, Super Regionals, but uh, were you a big time Northwestern fan yesterday? I mean, how much had yesterday been out for you? Yes, uh, we thought that was definitely in our favor. Northwestern just had to win one of the games, and I guess Texas just sparked a rally and came back, and it is what it is, and now we just have to go and get the job done. Were you able to watch any of that on the Longhorn Network, or was that on the internet or what? No, I, I don't know. Since it wasn't on TV, I didn't really try too hard to watch it. Um, I did go game tracker on the second game, but I didn't watch it at all. What are your thoughts of playing Texas? Uh, I think we have a pretty good shot. I mean, um, we're going to go down early, get used to the weather, time change and stuff like that. And uh, really, we just have to keep focus on our game and not theirs. And we'll have a good shot at winning the series. Have you watched any film? Have you scouted them at all? I mean, have you guys met already to, to check things out? We haven't. That's uh, probably what we're going to do today. And uh, most likely, again, on the road, uh, we do have uh, video sessions before like we practice and stuff like that. So, so you guys have cruised through the regionals the last three years, and you kind of stumbled in the Super Regionals the last two years. You know, talk about what, what you need to do differently this time or what maybe you've learned from those past experiences that you think will help you this weekend. Um, yeah, from past experience, we were just happy to be in Super Regionals. And now it's just that it's not, um, that's not really our goal. Our goal is to get past it, and we need a. We need to relieve some of the pressure on Jess by making a better defense, less errors, and then keep scoring more runs than the other team is really our goal. But um, what was I gonna say? It's we just well we have to keep with our game, honestly. But yeah, that's our goal. Last year that Florida team was real powerful, and they just hit so well. You know, talk about Texas. You know, Texas has similar numbers to you across the board. Do you feel like this mm -hmm. is a more even matchup than what you guys had last year against Florida? I do, I do. And um, yeah, Florida had like the good hitting teams, but we kind of let them beat us. Like they, I think it is an even matchup. And um, we have more people, like last year we relied on just one person to get it done for us. And now we have more people to rely on. And um, everyone has a job to do. And if we just all do our jobs, we'll should be fine. First year you came in as a freshman to kind of wide-eye to the whole regional, super regional format. Last year, I think you guys kind of felt that, that you certainly could have played better and uh, showed yourself a lot better. It's now year three, is there a different mindset going into things? I mean, you guys have a discussion here for the last couple of days of, okay, been there. Oh, that's yeah, the especially um, my class, we feel like this is a hump that we get stopped at every time and we have to overcome it. And we're definitely coming in with a lot more confidence than we did. Everything was so new to us before and everything that we did was an accomplishment because we never did it before. But now we did all this stuff, so we just had to one-up ourselves. You guys thought maybe this would be the year that you could host a Super Regional as well, and that's yeah. the first regional. Is there still sort of that monkey off your back, or not monkey off your back, but something you, you feel like you have to prove the, the doubters wrong? No, not really. Like, what do you mean? Like in terms of not getting that top eight seed and being able to host a Super Regional. Yeah, yeah, honestly, it does feel like we have some doubters, and it's always it's always a good spark in us to prove them wrong. I mean, there are always going to be people that are going to doubt us. So it's good for each other. Of those 16 teams, you guys have played six of them. You've beaten every single one of them, other than Alabama, which you only had in a one-game mm -hmm. series. How much confidence does that give you to when you look at those 16 teams and you say, hey, we've competed against quite a few of those and we, we beat quite a few of those. It gives us a ton of confidence. I mean, we don't have really fear of making mistakes because we know that we could play with them and we're part of the top teams. And really it just comes down to um, who wants it more in that day. You know, you said the first year you're there, you're kind of just happy to be there. But now when you see all those teams that, you, that you've that gone up against and beaten, do you feel like you deserve to be there, that, that you deserve, this is the right place for you guys to be in this final 16? Yes, I think we definitely deserve it's top 16 and uh, top eight. We deserve to be in top eight, too. And um, all the people that don't think we're going to get there, it would be a nice step for us to show them all. You're on the road the last two years for regionals. Tell me how nice it was to be at home for a change to play it was great. I mean, our fans are always are um, always lift us up, and uh, whenever we do do good, they're cheering and stuff. And, and you take that energy into your bats and into defense, and Jess gets hyped and pitching, and it's always great to have that. But um, I would say that we're pretty. We could bring that with us on the road as well, so we're not like too missing it. But we have not played Texas before. 
Uh, not that I, not since I've been here. Football or youth growing up? Mm -hmm. Barbecue, like barbecue? <laughs> Heck yeah. <laughs> I do love barbecue, yeah. <laughs> Jeff's gonna take you guys out. Though. He's all for it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Thank you.